Thank you for watching CTR TV. I'm Christy Olds, and this is your weekly update. Members should check their email for an additional list of answers to frequently asked questions about the new law addressing real estate teams here in Connecticut. CTR sent the third FAQ sheet on October 28th. Members can access all of the questions and answers on the CTR website under the Legal tab. You will need to log in to access that page. CTR worked with the Department of Consumer Protection to get answers to questions asked by members. If you have additional questions not yet addressed, email them to jen at ctrealtors.com. The law regarding teams takes effect on January 1st, 2022. Time to share another local Realtor of the Year. The New Haven Middlesex Association of Realtors selected Doug Blackwood for the honor. Doug has been a realtor since 2017, joining the industry after a career in construction. He's a member of the New Haven Middlesex Board of Directors and is the chair of the association's Young Professionals Network. Congratulations to Doug. New Haven Middlesex announced the 2021 Realtor of the Year during its annual trade show, which was held outside the association's office in Guilford. There's still time to accept a challenge from the National Association of Realtors. We're going to raise the bar in our industry by letting people know that we're just not here to sell homes. We're here to give back to people's lives when they need it the most. NAR issued a regional challenge for disaster relief to benefit the Realtors Relief Foundation as part of the fund's 20th anniversary campaign. The goal for New England is $45,000 and there's still a ways to go to meet that goal. A donation of any amount makes a difference. The Realtors Relief Foundation provides immediate assistance to help those impacted by natural disasters that damage or destroy homes. When you think about the Realtor Relief Foundation, it is the essence of everything we do. Whether it's a tornado in Arkansas, a hurricane in Florida, fires in California, our realtor community all around the country instantly goes to work. The regional challenge is part of an effort to honor the past and prepare for the future. You can donate online by going to ctrealtors.com slash RRF or text region one to 71777 to get the donation link right on your phone. Two cities in Connecticut rank in the top 10 in the country as the most affordable cities for condo buyers. The ranking by Forbes advisor lists Hartford as the third most affordable city in which to buy a condo with a median price of about $104,000. Bridgeport came in 10th on that list with a median condo price of about $150,000. The listing is part of a broader look at the best cities for first time buyers. Check it out at ctrealtors.com affordable. That is your weekly update. I'm Christy Olds for CTR TV.